Hello, orchestra students. I am missing you so much, and I want you to know I love you. And I want to give you a little message today of encouragement. This is us last week. Um, most of us were kind of carefree, bouncing around and doing whatever we did. And we were buoyant, and we were looking forward to things like festivals. My ninth graders had done a wonderful festival at the U of U. It was a great week. And then we started hearing some stuff about coronavirus. Of course, we'd been hearing about it for a while, but started getting closer and there were some cases confirmed in Utah. So there started to be some uncertainty. And Friday, the governor announced that all Utah schools were canceled. And the superintendent at some point announced that all the trips were canceled. And that meant the Woods Cross trip to Anaheim was canceled, we confirmed recently. We also found out that all our festivals are canceled. That includes solo and ensemble and our large group festivals. And then today there's an earthquake and just all sorts of things going on that make this an interesting time in our lives. And it feels heavy and we don't know what to do all the time. There's all this uncertainty and anxiety going on and we listen to the news too much and we get a little bit depressed about it. So anyway, we're down here um, feeling heavy and I'm going to give you a suggestion of what to do about that right now. I am a big fan of getting up early and moving your body and exercising and making sure you do something for your body every day. Drink a lot of water, eat your vegetables, eat real food. Make sure you get up and shower. Make sure you try to stay on some kind of a schedule so that your body isn't thrown out of whack. And then you try to take care of yourself intellectually by reading, practicing every day. Make sure you're doing something on your instrument every single day. Uh, make sure that you're feeding your spirit every day. Make sure that you're doing something that uplifts you and inspires you. And trying to serve others. Do, do some things socially. Try to make a difference for people around you, whether that's by text or calling or whatever you can during this time. And maybe you get a little bit of help from somebody. Like, I'm going to have my husband shake this up a little bit. He's the one that is filming right now. He's going to shake for me, and I'm getting a little bit of support from him and other people around you. And I just keep going, and I keep moving every single day, and I keep trying and keep working at things. Maybe there are some setbacks. Maybe it takes a while, but pretty soon, you're up on top. And even though the circumstances haven't changed, you are in a better place to deal with these things because you've been doing stuff. And so I just really want to encourage you to do some things this week and the next that will help you as a person and help you rise above all these circumstances. I believe in you. I love you guys. You're amazing. Let's keep going.